Hello everyone, and welcome back to part 5 of Fatal Frame. Uh, <laughs> last time, uh, you know how it was last time. Do I need to recount that tragedy? Last time was atrocious. We survived the first night, and we've moved into the second night of Demon Tag, and we've just entered this lovely space. Um, and for us to proceed, we need to go back once again uh, into a previous room. We're going to go back in here to this room here, the burial room, because in this corner there is some candles that need to be lit. And I believe the photo is all the red ones. So three white, three red. And we must light the red ones. And then we're gonna get the item that we that we so desire. So this is gonna be fun. Get ready for some more fatal frame. I can't, I can't wait. I'm so excited. Just so happy to be here. Uh, there's nothing I love more than running through dark areas where uh, ghosts can come out uh, at, at any time. I've forgotten the controls clearly. I'm like, how do I, how do I mount a ladder? It seems to not be working out for me. Just let me out of here, please. Very interesting. You, get, you do get you do get stuck on the environment very quickly, and very easily. Like narrow walkways is quite difficult because you'll see your character like glitch out. Love these angles. They're always just so friendly and nice. I don't even feel like I'm gonna get attacked. At least we're close to where we need to be. We don't have to go too far. Never mind. Oh, hello. Girl pointing. There you go. Well, she kind of helps us out. <laughs> we knew where we had to go, but she's like... Uh, we got the we got the hint again if we do it here. Okay. Put the photo in my file. Okay, so we've got a bo we've got a matchstick, so we'll I can't unlight that candle. Oh no, it's one of the, okay, it's it's like this. You're going to be like this, are you? Okay. Oh no. Okay. When you light one, the ones adjacent to it turn off. Hey, okay. Um. Really, the, the sad part is not being able to turn them off. Unlocked. There it is. 
There is an old scroll inside the box. It's a painting of Demon Tag. I've seen this somewhere before. Oh my god, get away from me, you're so close. I don't even feel like I got a chance to respond there. <laughs> my eyes. But somehow I can see where you are and I keep teleporting exactly behind you. Straight up harassment, dude. Do we have a HR department? For, um... You know? Horror resources? Don't whisper. Like, why is there a whisper in this room? <laughs> I thought I was done with that. At least we didn't have to go back too far. Why? Why? What is with this atmosphere? Oh, God. Oh, was that? Oh, was there maybe a ghost in that hallway? But we got to the end, so he's given up the chase. Lucky me. I'm such a blessed individual. Happy to be here. Loving life. I'm not sure what's going on with, with the ladders. For some reason... Interacting with the ladders. There we go. God. I haven't had this much trouble with the ladders before. They just aren't really responding as well as like the doors are or something. There's nothing different in terms of the controls. Something about this room, perhaps. Unresponsive letters. There's a place for hanging something. I wonder if it's advice for opening this gate. Oops. Oh, hang on. Oh, wait. So I need the mask with the eyes, actually. So hang on, I've got the demon tag. Fuck, where was the... Where was the demon tag? That makes things a little more difficult. Oh, was it... Was it that one? Oh, damn. Okay, hang on. I have, uh... This is what happens when you take a break between episodes. It's for some reason I was like, yes, the demon tag thing, you bring it back here. I completely forgot about this mask. Alright, we've got to go find a door that's got a demon tag, a talisman on it.
think I'll look at this door. And then if not, we could even try and have a look in the mansion where we haven't been yet, but I'm pretty sure we must have seen where we're supposed to be. Max out our speed. Oh, hang on. This door is locked. Could this be the demon tag one? No, it's locked from the other side. Okay. I mean, that's good to know. We're not going back that way. out here so much. This is my least favorite area. No. Yeah. Yep. Hi. Hello again. At this point, we know each other very well, don't we? <laughs> you persisted. <laughs> Just haunted by this broken neck girl, man. Okay. And here we go. It seems to be locked. Okay, so it's not this door. Ah, uh, shit. Oh, it might be in the doll. It might just be in the doll room itself. Because it's associated with the demon tag, and that's where the kids are. <clears throat> or where they woke us up in. Children laughing. Take me with you. What? I've been waiting so long. Something shows in the photo. Oh, it's the ghost. Okay. Put the photo in my file. There's an odd ball on the shelf. The doll's hair is so long I can't see her face. There are four dolls and a stand with a drawer in it. The drawer seems to be locked. Oh. Uh -huh. Can you not... Can you not do that? <laughs> You're like walking past and things fall off. Many Japanese dolls on a red mat. Red 
row of red dolls cover their eyes with their hands. There's a diary. Oh, ladies' diary scrap. <clears throat> June 10th. Mikosha really seems to like this mansion. She's playing demon tag here with her neighborhood friends again today. I guess a big mansion is the perfect place for kids to play. But for people in my sickly condition, it's a little too big. Today was a wonderful day. My husband, my daughter, and I took a walk in the mountains. I'm feeling pretty good these days, and I was even able to walk quite a distance today. I had so much fun. Okay, so this room did give us some new stuff, but it also didn't give us the answers we're seeking. A demon tag. Maybe I am missing something in that, this final room. But I need this, I need this mask. Stone. We won't be able to do this because this is cracked. I love that part of uh, horror games where you get lost because then you're just stuck wandering around getting endlessly scared and spooked for no reason. <sighs> oh, ho, ho. That's my face. Like, that is right in there. That's right in my face. That's like, you know, no personal space face, right? Holy shit. Oh, wait. Ugh. What the fuck? How long is it going to take for you to, like... Okay, fucking hell. I'm trying to do damage to you. When you're going to attack me. Oh, my God! How close do you want to get? How close did you want to get without attacking me? <laughs> what the fuck? So sometimes you get the ghost, like goes into a blue bowl and then explodes and then sometimes it like absorbs into you wondering if that means that like that's like when you defeat it for good or something and it never comes back so every time I make a mistake and I go somewhere that I'm not supposed to I'm being haunted by the girl with the broken neck That's locked. We went in there. Nothing here. Oh, hang on. Go up the... I could... Oh, shit. There's a staircase here. Alright, go up these stairs. It's... This is, like, the last place that I can check. Is staircase. I forgot that there was the upstairs section of this area. Yeah, don't do that. Up the stairs, please. Now, which one is it? Let's find out. Oh, this is the one that's too small. Locked from the other side. Let's board it up. No, 
thank you. Okay, both of these are inaccessible too. Okay, so demon tag. Shit. Girl pulled through door is what that photo is. That's our clue, I think. Girl pulled through door? Well, this would be like a mirror. Is this... Hang on. Is this this mirror down here? A mirror like the one at the entrance. Whoa, what if these are, what if these end up being fast travel points? What if these end up being fast travel points? She can travel through them. What if we can? Fuck, where are other mirrors? She's being pulled through a door. Should we go back to another shrine? You're being pulled through. Sounds like a different ghost entirely. Oh my god, it is a different ghost entirely. I'm like, you don't see him! Like the broken neck girl. Alright, that wasn't a scary ghost. I finally mastered my fears. You are not a scary ghost at all. You are a bug under my boot that is my camera. I'm going back in here because, so the girl was pulled through the door. The demon tag, what are you looking at? The demon tag thing looks like it's like associated with the, with the kids. There are four dolls in a stand in the drawer. Like, that seems weird. Girl pulled through door. Is that in this room? Because the photo was taken like right here. Oh shit, what the fuck? There's a place for hanging a scroll on the wall. This is where you use the demon tag scroll. What the f- Doesn't really- what? I guess that kind of looks like a door. When I hung up the demon tag scroll, I heard an unlocking sound from the wall. Wow. Okay. 
Oh, and shit, we're here. We're in this part of the mansion. Wow. I have to give this mirror to that man. How am I supposed to <laughs> photo like photo these ghosts when they just zip zaps up so quickly? Another spirit stone. Oh yeah, because we're going back in time, aren't we? There, so we're being sort of like being shown aspects of the past. Lady's Diary, June 18th. So we were doing September, now we're going back to June, but is it in the same year? That camera seems to have some kind of uncanny power. Oh my God, hang on. Hang on, our mother is coming into this somehow. Is the lady di is the lady's diary our mother's diary, or is Mikoto our mother? I need to go back. To I need to have a look at this um, family chart again because we have this camera. That camera seems to have some kind of uncanny power. It can capture things that aren't even there. Mikoto begged me to let her have the camera back. I don't understand the thinking, the things that the camera captures, but I know I, I can never let Mikoto see them. I have to protect her. Something terrible is going to happen. I can feel it. Put the piece of a woman's diary in my file. Hold on. Hold the phone. What's our mother's name? Miyuki. She possessed spiritual powers and gave the camera to Miku. She gave us the camera. Oh, hang on. Folklorist's wife. The mansion they moved to. The camera capturing things. Folklorist's wife. I kind of love that we're like trying to guess who's the lady. And then the game is like, it's the folklorist's wife, you idiot. Okay. Mikoso seems to really like the mansion. So the folklorists moved here. Love the mansion. Yay. My husband, my daughter, and I took a walk in the mountains. Wow, amazing. And this camera has, uh, has somehow ended up in our mother's hands. So I'm wondering if... Um, Mikoto is maybe like... Maybe our mother changed her name or some shit to get away from this place and then we've been just called back here like destiny okay we've got stuff to do now we were lost and now we are lost in a different room A scroll with a picture of flowers on it is hanging here. It's faded and sad now. Something shiny. Spirit stone. Pretty ornamental dish. I remember this. Yeah, don't do that. Remember when I was like, cool, we're not going to this part of the mansion because that door's locked? It's just like the way that when you enter a room, it's just silence, right? Like, because the ambient noise resets, but it's also just like silence as in, is a ghost about to appear or something more? Or nothing. Votive lamp is lit. I wonder who lit it.
What the fuck, child? Oh! Oh, man. Hide and seek with a fuck. Ah! Hide and seek with a goddamn child. Jesus, get off of me. Oh, dude, I thought I would. <gasps> the fucking hell, child. Get out of here. Drop kick the kid. Something shiny where the ghost stood. <gasps> Took back the holy mirror. I wonder what this mirror means. Ooh. Okay. Mirror piece. Oh, yes, because the kid stole it. Okay. So we've got one piece of the mirror. shows in the photo the kid being grabbed just like this these long-armed ghosts are the ones that are like grabbing them dust has been disturbed around the sunken fireplace as if it's been used recently oh there's a piece of paper with writing in front of the clock child's writing isn't Mikoto ever going to come find me? We're playing demon tag and she's supposed to be the demon. Did she quit maybe? Hey, I wonder if Mikoto likes me. If she ever comes and finds me, maybe I'll just ask her. So in the Monokata family, we have Ye Munakata, which is Ryozo Munakata's wife. One of the reasons Ryozo moved his family to the mansion was for Ye's sickness. Ryozo and Ye Munakata's daughter, she moved to Himuru Mansion with her parents. think that Mikoto grows up to then marry and take on a new last name and changes her name to Miyuki. Or it's like they, they're related. Miyuki, Miyuki's face is exactly the same. Exactly the same as Ye's face. So if Makoto grows up to look like her mother, especially with the, the camera connection, mm. that's all I have to say about that so far. Now, we're probably being lured upstairs by that bowl, but we're going to go here. We'll have a look around the base level. Why 
Why does why? Why does this look the way that it does? What the fuck is this? Cold air is flowing in through a big hole in the floor. Something fell through here. Okay. So that was not like that before. Oh, this thing. Right. There used to be a thing on the door. Yeah. The mask shows in the photo. It looks like the mask that used to hang here. Strange characters on the wall decoration. There's a peg for hanging something. Now this candle is lit. Right. Oh, I'm stuck. What if we just left and never came back? Sorry, bro. I don't want to be here anymore. <laughs> Front door won't open as if something is holding it. Seems sealed by a powerful force. Maybe that candle in that room with the moon thing will be lit now and we can actually see what that might mean. supposed to go here instead of upstairs then? <laughs> Fucking hell man. Alright, what are, what what are you? Like, what are you? Why are you here? Why can't you just leave me alone? Pressed it as I got attacked. Oh uh, man. Trying that that time. <laughs> I think the hardest part is running away from the ghost doesn't really work because like it instantly like they they teleport to be like right on top of you it's very oppressive you mind if you try if you try and run away from the ghost it's just like i'll try and use the slow down spirit stone Are you? That didn't slow her for long at all. I was trying to get the critical hits, but <laughs> just had such a weird attack pattern. 
of I'm just going to float around you until I attack you in a millisecond. Jesus. <sighs> Who is this? Long hair woman. Okay. I pushed, but the door went open, locked from the other side. It's an old Shinto household altar here. Is there anything to be done here? It was just like a encounter, but I get some items. Rewarded for my exploration with pain and suffering. Okay, love that for me. Alright, let's go, shall we? Oh. Let's get out of here. That was so fun. We're working up a resistance to the game now. That was not where we were meant to go. Building up an immunity to Fatal Frame. It's working. Exposure therapy is real. Just took five episodes for me to calm the fuck down. Some other place shows in the photo. Fuck, I was just there. <laughs> like, I was just there. All right, we'll go back to the rope hallway. Found a piece of an old diary. Old diary scrap. June 13th, Mikoto found an odd camera. She said she found it in the mansion when she was playing Demon Tag. I tried asking her exactly we're in the mansion, but she just keeps saying a girl in a white kimono gave it to her. I can't find out any more about it. I had a look at the camera Makoto found yesterday, but I didn't see anything special about it. It was probably left here some time ago by somebody that came to investigate the mansion. The weather was wonderful today, and Ye seems to be feeling better. The three of us decided to take a walk in the mountains. Ye hadn't been out in a long time, and she seemed to really enjoy it. She had fun with Makoto's camera, taking pictures with it all day long. So that would be the husband's diary. You know what I really like about that is that explains why there's so much film uh, in the mansion. We're like picking up a bunch of uh, picking up a bunch of uh, <laughs> film everywhere and going, oh, this is funny. The camera was given by the girl in the white kimono. Perhaps the girl in the white kimono gave it to our mother. And they might not be related, but I think they might be. Now, something to note as well. This is the third diary of the folklorist. Not the first or the second. So it means that we either haven't found two of them yet when we're supposed to, or they uh, potentially get given to us in a different order. Also, this staircase is actually complete. Uh, it's a broken staircase during night one. Would you look at that? All right, photo in this hallway. Oh, did you have to do that? Vengeance. Did you have to have that face on? Could you have tried not doing that? Put on a happy face.
Let me turn up the volume so you can hear this. Turn the volume back down just in case it gets too loud, but this music that was playing was very quiet. Oh! So that's the folklorist. So this is what this one's lit. There's a picture of the moon on the partition screen. Oh, it's actually not do I swear it was gonna be like when I saw that, I was like, oh, that's gonna be like a cool light puzzle. Is there's light behind the picture of a moon? No? Okay. Fuck me, I guess. Several pieces of paper. Mafuyu's note! It looks like the ghosts of the women with the gouged out eyes react strongly to sounds. If I'm really quiet, I can get away without being noticed. Wow. Thanks, Mafuyu. You're so much smarter than me. Something shiny underneath the urn. Stone mirror. Okay, hang on. We got another stone mirror. Okay, so blind woman. Just don't make noise, you know? It's easy. Fatal frame. Another stoned mirror in the tatami room. So if we ever need- Oh, actually, fuck it. You know what I just realized? Oh, no, no, no. That's fine. I'm pretty sure they stay there even when the days change. So we've got a few stone mirrors uh, to pick up. hate this angle. No dust. No dust. That's because we're in the past now. There's something inside the drawer. Spirit stone. Oh shit, I entered the latch on the door. Oh shit. Okay, so we've got that shortcut to go there now as well. Fun. Okay, that's a good little shortcut. Slowly revealing spots for us to go. Let's save the game. Wonderful. This is going to be where we bring this episode of Fatal Frame to a close. Thank you so much for joining me today as we navigate more of the mansion. And we're starting to unravel new diary entries based to the, the folklorist's family who stayed here. The mystery of the camera while also getting our pants uh, shat for us. You know, it's not me that's doing it. It's, the game is doing it for me. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining me today for Fatal Frame. Uh, I'm having a good time. I'm having a great time. It's just a positive, happy, smiley adventure. Feel good adventure time. You know what I mean? Like, it's just this, you can't be sad, you can't be scared while playing Fatal Frame. You know, it's great. I hope you're enjoying the playthrough and I hope you've enjoyed this episode and I will see you next time.